Oh, welcome to Fanny Magnet and today we'll take a quick look on how we can install Windows 7 on a laptop. Uh, in order to install Windows 7 you need a DVD or you can use this a flash drive you know a 4 or 8 gigs of flash drive to install Windows 7. So I'm going to plug this Windows 7 USB flash drive uh, in the port of a laptop USB port and or click on turn on now and as soon you press the turn on button you have to press F9 that's for the quick bias mode there we go so here I'm getting uh, your you can see it's a boot option menu so I'm going to select a USB hard drive and click let me zoom in the mm -hmm. yeah so I'm going to select USB hard drives sand sand disk and hit enter now and it says press any key so I'm going to press enter and it is loading Windows files the step is very simple you just have to follow a few instructions and you will have Windows 7 loaded on the computer so this is the very first screen or you get when you are installing windows so I'm going to click next then install windows here then I'm going to select Windows 7 Ultimate here and we'll click next then the agreement and next uh, you get an option to upgrade from Windows Vista to Windows 7 but I'm going to do a fresh installation for that you have to click on the custom and then I have a partition here so I'm going to delete uh, the whole partition first and then we'll try alright so I'm going to create a partition here so this will be uh, initially this uh, this uh, 195 you see that's a C drive in which all the applications will get installed and this is for the data and other things which I will keep so I'm going to select this 195 gigs and click on next and this is how the windows will get installed in your PC So now uh, the Windows has uh, come to a stage where it is it is going to you know it is trying to prepare the computer for the first time, and in the same process it will it is also going to ask us about uh, the username and the password, the time and all. 
let's take a look so it is asking me to type a username so I'm going to type a username that is owner O W N E R and click on next and I don't want to set any password now so I'm going to click next ask me later I'll set the time later on so I'll click next so we are done now so Windows 7 Ultimate is installed successfully now and here we go we have um, the desktop screen now so if you have any questions or query about the, for the installation you can comment down below please do subscribe and share this video thank you